Lobsters are a member of the marine crustacean family. They have long bodies and muscular tails, and they live in crevices or caverns on the ocean floor. Three of their five pairs of legs have claws including their first pair, which is frequently larger than the rest. In coastal areas where they are prevalent, lobsters are frequently one of the most valuable commodities, highly appreciated as seafood, and significant commercially. Lobsters are an example of an invertebrate with a robust protective exoskeleton. Like the bulk of arthropods, lobsters must shed in order to develop, which leaves them susceptible. While shedding, several creatures change their color. A lobster has eight walking legs, the first of which is larger than the others. The front three pairs of these legs are covered in claws. Due to the biological classification of their front pincers as legs, they belong to the class decapods. While most arthropods, including lobsters, have bilaterally symmetrical claws, some genera have uneven, specialized claws. While lobsters come in a variety of colors, they tend to be dark in color, either blue-green or greenish-brown to blend in with the ocean floor. Only a tiny fraction of the millions of lobsters caught each year have odd colors, and since they are so rare, they are usually not eaten, but instead are donated to aquariums or released back into the wild. Unusual pigmentation, such as albinism or hermaphroditism, typically has a hereditary component. All lobsters, with the exception of albinos, contain astaxanthin, which gives them their bright red color when cooked. Once cooked, lobster with special coloring doesn't seem to impact the flavor. It's common for lobsters to be muddy brownish green when they're fished out of the water, but everyone knows that once they're cooked, they become a vibrant pinky reddish color. However, what most people don't know is that there are many uncommon color morph variants of lobster out there. In this video we will see species of lobsters with color morph variants that are relatively rare in the wild. Blue Lobsters The color of a lobster, whether blue or another shade, might depend on a number of things, including its diet and habitat. However, some of these blue lobsters are just blue by nature, typically as a result of a blue lobster father. A blue lobster harvest is a well-known symbol of luck and with good cause. You have a 1 in 2 million chance of catching them, say many scientists and researchers. However, several research disputes this figure and assert that the chances are actually much higher. However, there is one thing that is certain. These striking blue lobsters are neither the only nor the most uncommon crazy colored crustaceans. Red Lobsters Red lobsters are more uncommon than blue lobsters. As of late, all lobsters that are fried alive tend to turn pinky red. The chances of discovering a live red lobster, on the other hand, are far lower than those of a blue lobster, with only a 1 in 10 million chance of doing so. Yellow Lobster Calico lobsters, sometimes known as yellow lobsters, are expected to only appear once every 30 million occurrences, making them much rarer than a red lobster that is still alive. In fact, one of these rare yellow lobster was rescued from a supermarket lobster tank in the United States in 2014 and reintroduced into the wild. The hues of these calico lobsters frequently fluctuate from a strong orange yellow to a very mild yellow. Similar to how a person's hair color is inherited, the calico coloration of the lobster comes from its parents. Multicolored or split-colored lobsters A different species of lobster is known as a half-and-half -half lobster because of the split in its pigmentation. Now, these half-and-half -half lobsters can often be half of any different lobster color, with some being half blue, and others being half calico. Split-colored lobsters are reported to have a genetic tendency for their look with calico lobsters. Researchers are still unsure of the likelihood of finding a half-and-half -half lobster, but many believe it to be one in 50 million. Albino or White Lobster you're probably thinking that a lobster with a 1 in 50 million probability of occurring must be rarer than that. Well, off the coast of Dorset, England, two fishermen caught a very rare albino lobster known as a crystal lobster. It was estimated that the lobster was roughly 30 years old. Having a wild albino lobster, which is the only lobster that doesn't turn red when cooked, is a 1 in 100 million chance. However, this catch is also noteworthy because it is only the third albino lobster to be caught in the UK over the past 30 years. 
Another distinguishing feature of this lobster is its age. Lobsters typically live for about 50 years in the wild. The fact that this albino lobster has lived for roughly 30 years is a small wonder, considering that the lobster's capacity to survive in the wild mostly rests on its ability to blend in with its surroundings. Its dark color helps it blend in with the murky bottom depths where it lives. Consequently, it takes incredible fortitude for a bright white lobster to have endured so long without camouflage and to avoid being eaten by a predator like a shark. This particular lobster is probably rarer than a cage full of blue, red, and calico lobsters combined, assuming you consider how improbable it is for a lobster with no camouflage to reach this age and the possibility that a crystal lobster has ever been caught.